Hello everyone. Welcome back to recipes with a touch of art. In today's recipe, we are going to make palak paneer. It's a colorful, nutritious Indian dish that can be served with Indian flatbreads or rice. To begin with, let's heat up 1 teaspoon of ghee or clarified butter in a heavy bottom pan. Add 1/4 teaspoon of cumin seeds to the hot ghee and let them splutter. Then add 2 to 3 garlic cloves and 1/4 onion chopped into big pieces. Sauté until onions turn glassy. Then add 1/4 cup of cherry tomatoes or 1 to 2 regular tomatoes. Sauté well. You may also add 1/4 inch piece of ginger and green chilies too if you like it spicy. Then add 2 teaspoon of coriander powder and add a pinch of turmeric powder. Add 1 teaspoon of Kashmiri chili powder and sauté well. In some of the recipes they do not use tomatoes, but I like them so I added them. Now we are adding 1/4 teaspoon of garam masala powder and salt to taste. Then sauté well and let it cool down. Once cool down, we will grind the mixture into a very smooth paste. In the meantime, let's heat up 1 teaspoon of ghee again and splutter 1/4 teaspoon of cumin seeds and then add whole garam masala which includes star anise, cardamom, bay leaves, cloves, black cardamom, nutmeg, etc. So now to this we add the ground paste and let it cook well. And once it is being cooked, we'll add a puree of half a cup of spinach leaves and sauté well. Mix well and sauté for another 2 minutes. We can see how the beautiful colors mix together. And this curry as I said is very colorful and very nutritious. Add more salt if needed, but keep in mind that spinach is naturally salty, so you may need less salt here. I'm adding milk instead of cream. You can use cream if you need to, and that gives a creamy texture to the curry. Now is the time to add paneer. Here I have homemade paneer which I have taken out from the freezer. Please check out our homemade paneer recipe. The link to which is given in the description box. Also, please check out our paneer butter masala recipe and let us know in the comments which one you like better. Now, crush some kasuri methi leaves and add in for a nice aroma. Add 1/4 teaspoon of sugar, which is the secret ingredient to enhance taste. Now, the palak paneer recipe is ready to be served. We hope you enjoy it. Please let us know in the comments how you like it and your suggestions too. We hope you are all staying safe and take care and enjoy yourself. Thank you.